Good morning, dear students. Today, in English class, I am going to do another page. That is page number fifty-nine. Having in your English book, okay? So, all of you, please open page number fifty-nine in your English book and watch the video very properly with the help of your parents. So, let's start. First of all, you have to write. C L A S S class then W O R K work class work date is a date so D A T E date today's date is twenty sixth oblique month is eleven oblique two thousand twenty one is the year see what written write the C O N C O N S O S O C O N S O N A N T N A N T C O N S O N A N T S C O N S O N A N T S I N T H E B L A N K S A N D S A Y T H E W O R D S M E A N S S O M E B L A N K S G I V E N H E R E Y O U H A V E T O W R I T E H E R E C O N S O N A N T S L I K E E A R L I E R C L A S S E S H E R E A L S O M E S S I N G C O N S O N A N T S E A R L I E R Y O U H A V E D O N E M E S S I N G V O W E L S N O T O D A Y I S M E S S I N G C O N S O N A N T S S O W H A T A R E T H E C O N S O N A N T S E X C E P T V O W E L S A L L T H E L E T T E R S A R E C O N S O N A N T S You all know about this. Earlier I discussed about it, isn't it? So except A E I O U, rest of the letters are all consonants. Okay. So here see, this is the stem. Means vapor is coming out of a kettle. So stem spelling how? S T E A M stem. S and T are the consonant letters okay next is c these are grass okay short plants with long narrow leaves are called grass so grass spelling g r a s s grass okay next is you all know about this this is a fish isn't it so fish spelling how f i s h fish So S and H are consonant letters. Here also G and R are consonant, isn't it? So next one is one boy is there, and these are his hands, isn't it? So H written here, A also written here, and we have to write another two consonant letters, H A and D hand. Isn't it so? N and D are consonants. Next is one boy. What he is doing to fill something with air? Here is balloon. So to fill balloon with air. Okay. So this is called blow. B L O W blow. Two cases. B L O W blow. Okay. B and L are consonants. Next is Here showing teeth, isn't it? So T E E T H teeth. T and H are consonants. Okay. Next one, see. This is the to move with a motion in water. A wave-like motion is called swim. Okay. So swim spelling how? S W I M swim. S and W are consonants. Next one, see one baby. What is what he she is doing? She or he? She, I think. The advent is there, no? So she is laughing. So L A U written L A U G H laugh. Isn't it? This is laugh. Earlier discussed about about laugh, isn't it? So baby is laughing. Next is see what is this? This is mask. Okay, a covering of the face to frighten others or to make afraid others. This is called M A S K mask. S and K are consonants. Okay, next is C. This is chess board, isn't it? So here written E S S. So chess spelling C H E S S chess. C and H are consonants. Next picture C. This action is karate. Okay, this is called kicking. A forceful attack with the foot. Okay, kicking is a post of uh, pose of a uh, pose of karate. So uh, K I C 
K, K. C and K are consonants. Next is some fishes are there, isn't it? So three written here, one also written, and this is the addition sign. So three and four, how much? One, two, three, four. Okay, so four fishes. Four not written here, four fishes, that means more than one. No, that's why we can write M A and Y many. Four and many same. No, many means more than one. And four also more than one. So N and Y are consonants. Next you see, one girl is there, what she is doing? She is thinking, something is going on in her mind. So she is thinking about that. In Hindi we say soch, which soch rehi hai. So think spelling how? T, H, I, N, K. Think, T and H are consonants. Next picture you see, this is the picture of march, walk in a military manner. Is called March M A R C H. Okay, some soldiers or some uh, militaries are marching. This is called March and C and H are consonants. Next is you all know about it. This is a train, isn't it? So train spelling how? T R A I N train. Train is a uh, land transport okay and T and R are consonants so hope you understood the chapter and you have to write this in your English book and learn this with the help of your parents okay